I would like to welcome you all the question paper discussion for the subject applied physics. This is the third session uh, for the particular question paper discussion, which is happened in the year of April, uh, May 2023. So far, we have discussed up to seven questions. Now we will be moving on uh, the question number eight. What is displacement current? Derive an expression for displacement current. First of all, you have to mention the the, uh, the definition of displacement current. Okay. Then uh, the derivation. What you are supposed to mention is the, the definition will be getting two marks. Will be allocated for allocated for two marks. Uh, this is our. Uh, general expression for displacement current. So you have to reach up to this expression. Del cross H is equal to J plus dou T by dou T. Ultimately, uh, you will be getting the expression as uh, ID is equal to J omega, J omega epsilon AB by D. So ultimately, you will be getting two marks. So totally, how much, uh, what's the total amount? Two total marks, two plus four plus two. Total eight marks. Then question number B. Uh, state Biot Savart law uh, and list four Maxwell equation in different forms. Okay, uh, Biot Savart law is one of the popular equation in the ma uh, in the ele electromagnetism. So first of all, what you are supposed to do is uh, you can write the Biot Savart law with the statement also. And this equation is very important. dB is equal to mu zero by four pi i d l sine theta by r square. So later, what you are supposed to use in field theory, you might have learned. You'll be learning, not at learn. You'll be learning. Uh, the same thing will be useful for your field theory. So four condition. This is the first condition. Uh, del dot e is equal to rho by epsilon. So uh, or uh, del uh, del dot d is equal to rho. Then uh, del dot b is equal to zero. Del cross e is equal to minus dou b by dou e. Uh, del cross h is equal to j plus dou d by dou t. These are the popular equations. Uh, uh, of biot savart law uh, uh, based on the Maxwell equation. Now, one of the applications of Max Maxwell equation. By using Maxwell equation, you can modify the biot savart law and you can write four conditions. Hope it is clear to everybody. So, at least you try to remember these equations. Okay. Now, uh, we'll be moving on. Uh, question number 8C. Please read question number 8C. Let me read first. Question number 8C is uh, find constancy such that A is equal to A plus AY then a unit vector ax uh, y plus bz unit vector ay uh, x plus cz uh, unit vector az is a solenoid okay you need to know what is a solenoid question number 8c so according to that there is one equation so as per the uh, the standard form del dot a is equal to dou ax by dou x plus dou ay by uh, dou y plus dou az by az so what you are supposed to do is you need to calculate uh, del dot a so ultimately, you'll be getting how uh, much uh, one plus one plus. This will be C only. Okay. So you know that del dot C, del dot C for this condition of solenoid condition, that will be del dot C will be is equal to zero. So what is remaining? Uh, two plus uh, C is equal to zero. So therefore, C is equal to minus two. Simple equation. You can uh, you'll be getting uh, the answer very easily. So okay. Con similarly, uh, there are different conditions. Uh, solenoid condition, uh, if it is a solenoidal, uh, definitely del dot A is equal to zero. Okay, curl, condition of curl. Many, many, there are different conditions that you have to remember. Question number 9A, what is Hall effect? Obtain the expression for Hall coefficient and express the Hall voltage in terms of Hall coefficient. So definitely, you are expected to write the definition of Hall effect. Uh, later, you have to write the equations. So these are the uh, equations. Possible to the diagram as well. Okay, these are the popular equation. Okay, please do remember, very important. Okay, if you cannot uh, derive, at least you try to remember those equations. So, uh, this is regarding the Hall effect, question from Hall effect. Don't leave the question Hall effect, it's most important. Explain construction and working of photodiode and mention its application. It carries the weightage of seven marks. See, construction of photodiode with the symbol, working of photodiode, how does it operate? Draw the relevant diagram. Any three application of photodiode. Okay, uh, so uh, these are the uh, various uh, applications of uh, various uh, segments which you need to include in the uh, topic photodiode. It carries the weightage of seven marks. Question number nine C. It's a numerical example. Planck constant uh, in a Planck constant experiment. H Planck constant means H the knee voltage uh, of a given uh, red LED emitting 
light of wavelength lambda is equal to 650 nanometer 650 into 10 to the power minus 9 meter is 1.08 volt e is equal to 1.08 volt calculate the plan constant very simple question carries the weightage of 5 marks uh, very 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 simple question plus 2 level question only e is equal to h into nu uh, where h uh, nu is equal to uh, c by lambda write down the equation from this you need to separate h h you are supposed to separate that is equal to lambda into ev by t ultimate you will be getting h is equal to 6.63 oh 63 61 is also okay 6.61 into 10 to the power minus 34 uh, joule second this is actually called a plank planks constant very important question okay question number 10 uh, 10 a uh, explain the construction and working of semiconductor laser and mention its applications. Okay. Uh, so you need to understand, you need to explain about construction of semiconductor laser carries the weightage of two marks. Don't forget to draw the diagram and working of semiconductor laser with the energy level. You have to recall band theory. Any three application you have to mention, it carries another three marks. Total eight marks. Mention the expression for hold and the electron concentration in an intrinsic semiconductor and derive the expression for electrical conductivity of a semiconductor. So this is actually the equation which is given. This is very important. Okay. Question number uh, 10c, the hall coefficient of material is minus 3.68 into 10 to the power minus 5 meter cube per coulomb. What is the type of charge carrier? Also calculate the uh, concentration. Uh, concentration. Here the type of charge carrier is of course electron. Um, the reason you know it carries the weightage of one mark. Uh, the equation uh, that is Rx is equal to minus 1 by N e into E. From this, you can compute the value of N e. So, N is equal to uh, you, can, you can reshuffle the equation and you can compute. It carries the weightage of two marks. I think it's clear to everybody. So, please go through all the previous year question paper. Prepare accordingly in this fashion. Okay. So, I already uh, prepared a detailed uh, question bank on the import based upon the important questions. Don't leave any questions. So, let me know if you have any questions. Happy learning. Thank you for watching this video.